I'm just gonna. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I didn't read this. Don't be alarmed. I just kind of like the way it looked again. Welcome back to Witty Life Questions. Today's question is going to be, a, this is a long one. This one's a doozy. If when you die, you could challenge death to a game where if you won, you could escape your demise. Which game would you choose? And this question is brought to you by Reddit. Everyone's favorite place to go and look at weird shit. <clears throat> oh fuck. I just ripped off. This is a weak paper. Which game would I kick death's ass? What? I'm terrible at everything. Um. That, I have a full a foolproof answer, which, uh, yeah, it's a foolproof answer. I can play a game of Thumb War with him. All right, if I had to choose a single game in which I think I could defeat death and be returned to life, I think the natural choice here is going to probably be Risk. All right, I get to choose any game, any game ever. Like, I can make up the game. Is this what we're doing? Because I would just play the game, uh, if your name's Chad, you win. Game. Actually, you know what? I would probably challenge death to some Arkham City free flow challenges. Um, well, I say Arkham City. It really any of the Arkham games. Because by the time, if experience holds any clue to what would happen, by the time I'm done setting the game up, by halfway, by halfway through the setup, death will have gotten so bored that he will just return me to life and go back home. The problem is, what if by some fucked up chance, death, his real name was Chad? And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. And then like he plays the whole like, well, I'm the dealer, I win bullshit. Kind of like the goddamn casinos do. And like takes all my chips and the chips are my soul. Um, I guess that would fuck me. You know, City or Night, one of the one of the later Arkham games, just challenge death like, hey, death beat my score. And then watches death fucking biffs it hard. Cause he's got bones for fingers. I got muscles, bam, there you go. <laughs> Some more, bam, hey, I got him. I don't think, aside from like a couple of times in my history, I've ever managed to sit through a whole game of Risk with anyone. I love that game. I fucking love that game. And if you love that game, you can feel free to get hold of me and we'll play that game together. To be honest, like when we launch the gaming channel, you will see that I am terrible pretty much every game. And I'm not sporty whatsoever. I'm not strong. I'm stronger than I look, but I'm not like lifting 300 pounds. Um, I can't even think of a single game I would win. And, and you know, he, he can pick to go first, or I guess it can pick to go first or second. I'd be like, oh yeah, Death, you can go first. Go ahead, set your score. And then I'll fucking kick his ass. Anytime I've ever tried to play that game with any of my friends, including Chad, I don't think I've ever tried to play it with David, but they always end up either quitting during the setup or by the time you're like 10, 20 minutes into the game, Chad especially, he'll start like removing his pieces from the board and purposely fucking himself because he's tired of the game. So he'll purposely make himself lose. Anytime you look away, he'll start removing pieces from the board that are his. I can, and I can do that. I can do that sneak with the, with the, the with the pointer finger. One, two, three, dingling, you're out. There you go. <laughs> Maybe that's how I fucking win. Like, oh, you, oh, your name's Chad too. Oh, I meant Chad with two D's. Death, and you only have one D. Even in your other name, Death, it's only got one. Uh, sad, sad. All this cries. I'm assuming Death would probably do the same and just like forfeit or walk away even before the game has begun. Or you could choose the wonderful game of Monopoly, which I also love, which seems to have that same curse because by the time you get about halfway through that game, everyone gets tired and fucking quits on you. And you're like, oh, what the fuck guys, isn't this fun? And they're like, no. And then if I go first, I'll be like, oh yeah, death, go ahead, beat that score. And then watch as he just fails completely. I would think that would have to be the game because I would totally lose. 
everything. Because you gotta assume death has been around for how long? And he's, I mean, he's busy. So maybe he doesn't have as much downtime to play these games. Maybe he's just as bad as I am. It's a foolproof method there. So I, I, I beat him. I beat him to it. So guys, if you ever want to challenge death to that, that's the game you gotta play, Thumb War. And I don't know if that's because I steamroll everybody in fucking Monopoly. I do, I do. I'm pretty good at Monopoly. I don't know if I can handle those pro people. And that is a thing. That is a thing. It's a weird thing, but that is a thing. There's like pro competitions for Monopoly. Check that shit out, it's weird. They have weird rules too. He's probably good at like archaic games. You know, like Kick the Rock. Or like Stick Ball. Or Chess. Or like, I don't know. Stoning. Um, all but guaranteed to come back to life. And then, you know, maybe, uh, maybe and the next time I die, he'll be like, oh, Death, you've been practicing? And it'll be like, yeah, fucking bring it. And then I'll just kick its ass again and again. You just have immortality that way. Monopoly is another one of those games I'm pretty sure Death would just quit halfway through because once again, I don't think I've ever managed to sit through a whole game of that without everyone else quitting, so. Oh, you know, the Vikings played baby pike. You know, where they throw your baby into a pike after they pillaged your village. He's probably good at that. Oh, he was there. He'd have to be there because, you know, he was taking their lives, so. One, two, three, four, I declare thumb war. Bam. You automatically win because death only has bones for fingers while you got muscles and everything. Yeah. Yeah, I pick those just because if that's any indicator of how it would go, death would just forfeit. And I wouldn't even have to bother trying to be good. I'd just play the game and he'd quit and be like, oh yeah, good luck with that, bud. You're fucking boring as shit. And I'd be like, whatever, I'm gone. You know, and I'd be back to life and I would go on to attempt to play Monopoly and Risk with more people in the future and inevitably they would all quit on me or whatever, so you know. <laughs> I won. Just give me a gold medal right now. Yeah, there you go. Or, you know, give me give me a belt. Be like, John Cena! There you go. Bam! <laughs> Bit disappointing, really, that those two games would be the ones I would pick. And for those reasons. But even if he did play, I'd probably steamroll him because I'm very good at both of those games. So. Either way, I suppose it's a win-win for me. I get to come back to life and torture more people with those two games and death gets to continue doing his thing just without me. But yeah, I'd choose the, the Chad name game. So, take that, death. Come at me, bro. Coming for you, death. Thanks for watching everybody, and if you enjoyed today's video, leave us a like by hammering that like button with your mouse button. You know, don't break your mouse. Don't break your mouse. And then go ahead and subscribe to us because you're of course going to want to stay up to date with what we do, don't you? Of course. And I mean, you also are going to want to let us know what answer you'd give to the question. So which question, or which question, which game would you challenge death to? And I don't know what everybody's answers is yet, but well, I- I chose to bore him to death with risk. <laughs> in Monopoly. I thought I, I thought of a I thought of a great answer. Oh, what was your answer? Well, my answer was I challenged him to Arkham. Arkham oh Batman God! Stuff. Yeah, David would just wreck him. Um, You'll see that someday. But no, I I thought we could we could challenge Death to a round of Charty McDennis. <gasps> Wouldn't that be great? We need to make that sketch everybody. An actual, an actual game. Yes, um, we've written it. We've written it. By the time you see this. Copyright. We, Fuck you. Well, that's copyright. Cause, well, but yeah, no. I, I get you. It's uh, our idea, damn it. If or maybe we can get those guys to help us. That would be amazing. Yeah. Uh, Sidetrack. I'm watching, sorry. Help us. If, <laughs> if you have another question that you want us to answer, go ahead and put it in the comment section. Um, they can give it to us the other ways, right? It's Twitter. Yeah, or, Twitter, Facebook. Facebook. Why don't we ever talk about that? I don't know. We don't use it. It's a good point. <laughs> Get your questions to us somehow. Our social media manager will inform us that you have given us a question and your name will be on there for kudos. We probably won't put where you gave it to us because we don't care. <laughs>